let us apply our concept so on page uh, 20, uh, 281 we do the exercise number five and uh, we look at part a x squared minus 10x plus 24 is zero these are three terms step one we need to factorize so we need to factorize in step one so this might be um, a perfect square so let us check if it's a perfect square what's the variable that when you square it gives you x squared is x now is 24 a perfect square it's not so therefore this is not a perfect square you cannot factorize this as a, in a perfect square um, form or method so we need another method which we call sum and product method and we start with plus 24 let us write all the possible factors that when you multiply them they give you plus 24 starting with plus 1 plus 24 minus 1 minus 24 plus 2 minus plus 12 minus 2 minus 12 and minus plus uh, 3 plus 8 minus 3 minus 8 plus 4 plus 6 minus 4 minus 6 i know it's a long way or it's they are too many factors but still we need to either have them in our heads or go over them in our heads or you can write them on scratch like i'm doing and after four we have uh, five no and six so we're back to six so that's it now i need two factors that when you multiply them gives you 24 and when you add them they give you minus 10 so if you look at um, if you look at these two factors when you multiply minus 4 times minus 6 you get plus 24 when you add minus 4 and minus 6 you get minus 10 so this these are the two factors that uh, the two divisors that we need so we replace them or we, we write them as two factors so x minus 4 and x minus 6 equals 0 so let us double check x times x is x squared minus 4 times minus 6 is plus 24 now we go for foiling n times n is minus 4x out times out is minus 6x add these two up will gives you will give you minus 10. so step one we're we're finished with it now we go to step two and find the solution so you put x minus 4 equals 0 so this is the first factor you replace it put it equal to 0 so the root is 4 when you take 4 to the other side it becomes plus 4 then the second factor x minus 6 equals 0 so x is equal to 6 4 and 6 are the solutions for this equation in other words if you replace x by 4 you are going to have x squared minus 10 times x plus 24 replacing x by 4 you will get the value 0 and replacing x by 6 you will also get the value 0 so these are the two values that when you replace them instead of x you will get a um, value which is equal to 0 so we say that these two solutions or uh, roots will satisfy the equation